Take away the money, don't give up your money Use Bitcoin whenever you pay Use Bitcoin whenever you pay Hi everybody, this is Tatiana Moroz and I'm here at South by Southwest. I'm here to talk to people about Bitcoin, music, and technology and innovation. It's so exciting and fun here. Let's go and meet some new friends. Hi everybody, my name is Tatiana Moroz and I'm here at South by Southwest with Tony Gallippi from BitPay and a new friend of ours, Melissa. And Melissa came over and she's wondering um, about Bitcoin and I thought this would be a really great opportunity to see how that would play out. So what do you know about Bitcoin and also, first of all, who are you and what are you doing here? Uh, my name is Melissa. Um, I'm a nurse and a therapist uh, and I just was really interested in seeing what this was all about. I do take uh, credit card payments from clients and look, looking for an easier way to do that. So that's why I want to find out more about it. Very cool. Have you heard about Bit Bitcoin before? I, I've heard of it, but I, want, I really didn't know I understand it. So that's why I came to, to see what y'all had to say. Okay, well, you came to the right place. Tony, why don't you tell Melissa a little bit about it? Sure. So Bitcoin is a virtual currency. It's another payment system, another payment network. Um, credit cards were designed in the 1950s. And, you know, we've added a whopping two new features to credit cards in 60 years. We've added a three-digit code on the back and a mag stripe. So they were never designed for the internet and they cause a lot of problems when you're trying to, to key in a customer's order or have them key it in over the internet. Um, because if you take, if you're a business and you take a credit card from somebody, it's your fault as a business if it, as if it turns out that credit card was stolen at the time. So Bitcoin is a much safer way to pay online. Um, it is a push transaction, meaning people actually push you the cash instead of giving you their credentials for you to pull money from their account. So it's safer for the consumer. Um, but it's also safer for the business because the payments are irreversible. So once you receive money, it's guaranteed to be yours. If a customer wants a refund, it's your choice to push the money back to them. So it's, it's lower risk and lower cost than every other form of payment that you have on your website. Uh, but not only that, is if you are a, a, a business that can sell internationally, um, Bitcoin is global, so you can easily add this as a payment method and start to take payments from customers in Central America, South America, Europe, Asia, Africa, um, you know, without any adding any additional hassle. That's wonderful. Mm -hmm. What's uh, did you tell her about the fees? Yeah, and uh, you know, our fees start at one percent and go down from there, so it's much more affordable for the business than credit cards. I think I pay three percent on what I have now, so that sounds a, bit, a lot better. <laughs> so what does she do now? So she can start by coming to bitpay.com and signing up for an account. Uh, from there, once you get approved, you can figure out which tool is going to be appropriate for your business. So if you have an e-commerce web store, we've got about 20 different plugins that you can install. If your website is written in uh, you know, Magento or WordPress or Drupal or any of the, the most popular shopping cart platforms. Um, for retail stores, we also have a point of sale app. So if you have an iPad or any kind of mobile phone you can use as your point of sale, you can use that to take payments. And if you're the kind of business that just sends out bills over email to people, we have a way for you to collect Bitcoin in those as well. Sounds good. Well, actually, I, I have a question. Tony, um, which I would, I would think of it. Uh, basically, so what if she doesn't want to hold her money in Bitcoin? How does that work? Like, how does the physical, okay, I bought something from her. Does she just have to stay in Bitcoin? And what if it goes up and down? What do you guys do about that? Sure. So one of the things that we're trying to do to make it easy for merchants, especially in the early days, which we are in the early days, is to try to take as much risk off the merchants as we can. So if you don't want to handle any Bitcoins yourself, we run the, the wallet for you. Um, and if you don't want to keep any of the Bitcoins, we can settle every day to your bank account. So you wouldn't have to worry about any up or down fluctuations because when the coins come in, we sell them right away. Um, so you don't have to worry about any exchange rate volatility risk. And you know, we also integrate with QuickBooks so we can give you downloads and reports of all your revenue sales and it integrates you know, just side by side with your credit card sales. So uh, it makes the reporting and reconciling of your Bitcoin sales a lot easier. And at that point, there's really no risk to you, right? We, we handle all the security risk, the technical risk, the volatility risk, uh, and the liability. So um, you just have a lower cost and lower risk way to get dollars in your bank account. Sounds good. <laughs> um, how fast is the money in the account? Uh, so we settle to banks the next day. So I, I can't put money in your account every five seconds, but we do a batch and you get settled every day. So it's the same as your credit cards, right? You get one deposit in your bank uh, for all the sales you made yesterday for your credit card sales and we operate much the same way. 
Cool. All right. Well, listen, if you have any more questions, I guess we could do that elsewhere. But there's also, where do you think she can find out more about Bitcoin just to get educated about it? I was trying to think of places to send people. I mean, Bitcoin.org. We've got those magazines. Bitcoin magazine is a little bit for the more hardcore. And the uh, and the, the beginners with why Bitcoin? I think that's a good start. That's where I would start. Yeah, this is where I would start, too. And it goes more into the, uh, the politics, the economics, the lifestyle around Bitcoin. Um, yeah. And then, of course, BitPay.com. <laughs> Learned a lot today. <laughs> Excellent. Thanks very much. If people want to find out about you, where do they go? Uh, I have angelswingscounseling.com. Excellent. Thanks very much for speaking with us. Appreciate it. Very nice to meet you both. Great. Thanks. Thanks. Great. Thanks. Take away the money. Don't give up your money. Use Bitcoin whenever you pay. Use Bitcoin whenever you pay.